guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video here on Mr. Builder. Today I'll be starting a Minecraft Let's Play because I've gotten a few comments in the comment section in previous videos stating that I should do a Let's Play. So here I am with that Let's Play for you. So off the bat, the first thing I see is that there's a village, which is good. So now it's time we loot the chest. Hopefully there's a blacksmith if there isn't a well. I mean, hopefully there should be an iron golem though. I mean, if there is, then cool, we'll just organize the strategy to kill him and take three iron. But hope, let's just see what's happening here. Yeah, and guys, there's one thing I wanted to say. If you want, if you want me to do a tutorial about something specifically, just say it in the comments, and then I'll do it. So yeah, if you want to see a, tutor a build tutorial 30 minutes long, then I'll make a build tutorial 30 minutes long. Just tell me. No thank you. Yeah, there's an iron golem over there. There's no blacksmith. Well, hopefully we can find some sort of iron in the chests. I don't think anything is in here, but yeah, nothing is. Oh no! Hopefully something's in this um this house. Yeah, there is. Cool. Let's just break the chest. It's much quicker. Why did it not break? There we go. Oh, nice. Ten pieces of bread. I'll take that. And four emeralds. Cool. But now I think it's time we start. We actually should get an axe and get some stone. But in this episode, I might just make a sort of small hillside base. But I mean, I will be going big. Like, at, maybe on episode 5 or 10, I'm going to be making a, a bigger house. But that bigger house, I already have a design for it. And if you want me to make a tutorial again, just leave a comment, I'll do it. But that bigger house will need a lot of resources. Like, I mean a lot. Oh, gosh. Let's not be stupid and make a bunch of crafting tables. Now let's make a wooden pickaxe. But guys, first thing I want to do is trap the villagers. They're very useful in the end game, like once you have a bit of diamonds and stuff. Because if you can trade with them, and then a farmer especially, you can just make a massive farm and then reap a lot of emeralds. So that will be something I'm going for. I mean, that's actually my first priority. Keeping these these people safe. Let's get one more for now. Or we'll get a bit more. So that's seven pieces of cobblestone. I'm just gonna make a knot. Oh, we should make a sword too. God. <laughs> then let's go kill the iron golem after right now, quickly. need our sticks. And then the axe. Cool. The sword. Oh my god. 
The sword, yes. Oh, shoot, I'm a stick short. And our shovel. Okay, cool. And now let's just go get some, um, dirt. Okay, let's get some dirt. Got a bit of saplings. So there's a dark oak forest and a birch forest nearby. The thing is, okay, well, I want a bit of oak. I mean, I, I mean, I want a lot of oak and a bit of birch. I'm glad I have a birch forest forest over there, but I might just have to use saplings and get oak, or I'd have to go out and find one, or an oak forest. I mean, hey, irony golem, come over here, buddy. Oh shoot, no irony golem, come on. If I hit him, hopefully he can't hit me, or else I'd be ashamed. How many bashes does this guy need? Hello? Why am I not able to hit him anymore? No, you shall die for me. How many hearts does this guy even have? Come on, just die. Hey, no, no, you can't hit me. I shall hit you. We'll quickly reduce the Oh no, he's gonna, he looks so bad. Oh, phew. Reduce the sound a bit. <sighs> Thank goodness. He got this iron. Wow, look at how much damage he did to our sword. He did like 75% or 60 at least. And now it's time we trap the villagers. So my strategy for trapping them, which might sound awkward, but it's to make a bunch of boats. Yeah, you heard that right, boats. I'm sure I made a button, but... What I'm just going to do is put the boat down here, get someone in. I myself will get in it. And then I'm gonna go to this villager and get him in and then just trap them. See now that they're in this boat, I'm just going to use my dirt and trap them because they're stuck. Hopefully I don't accidentally break the boat. Oh shoot. Man, these villagers take up a lot of space. Well, oh, great, I need more dirt. Hopefully we can just trap four villagers and then later on breed them. Oh, we don't need that piece here. So we'll just put here and here. Wow, I made a pretty big home for these guys. We need a lot more dirt. But yeah, guys, if you have any project ideas of what I should do in the future, 
Just leave it down in the comments, and no matter how silly they are, I'll try and do them. I mean, maybe I wouldn't be able to do them now because it's the early phase, but once I get a bit more resources, I will definitely do them for you guys. So let's just enclose these guys. Okay, there you go. And that's how you safely enclose villagers. Good guy. Good, good, good. Come on, get in this boat, guys. Hey, no, this villager can't. Come on, can we somehow get four? No, it's becoming dark, so I'm just gonna steal their beds. I'm just spamming the bed at this point. Spam. When will I be able to sleep in this? Come on, it's surely evening. It's surely night. <laughs> Come on, fine, I'll eat a piece of bread and then sleep. Hello, bread? Can you eat? Okay, cool. Okay, thankfully these villagers stayed safe throughout the night. This should be enough dirt to trap him. I don't want to trap only one, but I guess I'll have to. Oh shoot, we don't need to go this time. I'll let them out later. Like maybe around episode 30. But until then, you're under my custody. Okay, that's three. And now I need to get the wheat, or this hay. And then make that into wheat, and then make that into bread. So one, one hay bale is equal to nine pieces of wheat. And then nine pieces of wheat is equal to three pieces of bread. So hopefully we can get a lot of bread. Just lower the volume there. Well, guys, leave a comment down below also. What do you, what tool do you think we should find?